Number five. Okay, how awesome is Stone Cold Steve Austin, the rattlesnake himself? There's not much I can say that already hasn't been said about him. Definitely one of the greatest wrestlers of all time, possibly the greatest wrestler of all time. Let me tell you this much. In my early 20s, I had zero interest in wrestling and felt like I was growing past it and maturing past it, got big into MMA and UFC, and it was Stone Cold Steve Austin that got me back into it because he was that awesome. His fight with Booker T in the grocery store was legendary. Stone Cold Steve Austin is legendary. Number four. Without making it too long-winded, Macho Man Randy Savage is definitely one of the coolest wrestlers of all time. As a kid, I did prefer the Hulkster, and he came from that Hulkster era in the 80s. But as I got older, I realized Macho Man was by far the cooler wrestler and even the better, more talented wrestler. He was absolutely awesome as Bonesaw and Spider-Man. And may he rest in peace. I think he got a lot of us into wrestling. His voice, his personality, his gimmick, his character, everything about him was just so awesome. And I appreciate the effort he gave to being Macho Man Randy Savage. A lot of these boring wrestlers nowadays could really take a page out, page out of his book on how to be a wicked, cool, rememberable wrestler. Number three. Oh, hell yeah, Chico Reza Ramon. He should be my number one. I'm telling you, one of the most underrated wrestlers of all time. Both his ladder matches with Shawn Michael were so legendary and so awesome. It's really, it's a surprise that I don't have Reza Ramon at number one, but there are two people I have before him. His physique, his just... His cool swagger, the Jerry Curl, much like Macho Man, he had that flair with his clothing as well. The way he danced and shook and you know, the way he made fun of the snot-nosed punk 123 kid. He was just super awesome. I know a lot of people were a big fan of him as Scott Hall in WCW, and I was as well. But I'll always know him as Razor Ramon and always love him more as Razor Ramon over the boring Scott Hall name. I just like gimmicks and characters and like the chains and everything you see right there, the toothpick and all. Number two. Okay, I'm not gonna sing the Bret Hart music, but the Bret Hart music was awesome. Being a Canadian, having Bret the Hitman Hart, the excellence of execution, succeed and become the big heavyweight champ of the WWF before it was WWE. He put everybody in that sharpshooter. And believe it, a lot of people put him in the sharpshooter as well. Even his little brother, Owen, may he rest in peace. Bret Hart was so badass that he could make Pink cool. He could make Canada cool. And that can sometimes be a real challenge in itself. All I can say is that Bret the Hitman Hart was my favorite wrestler in the 90s. And he probably should be number one on this list, like Razor Ramon, like Macho Man. But after some long thought, he did find himself in the number two spot. Number one. I'm not going to lie, it was pretty difficult picking my favorite wrestler of all time. In fact, everyone on this list was debatably my favorite wrestler of all time. But when I had to think about HBK, the heartbreak kid, Shawn Michaels, the most charismatic and flamboyant wrestler ever, I absolutely think so. Sweet Chin Music was amazing. Him creating DX with the whole suck it was absolutely legendary and awesome. Him starting off with the Rockers and Marty Jannetty was definitely amazing. His clothing, his dancing, his music, everything about Shawn Michaels, the hair. It just, he is truly got to be one of the most dedicated wrestlers ever. One of the most talented wrestlers ever. He is just the full package when it comes to great wrestlers. There's still many people that didn't make this list that could many ways be my favorite wrestler. But after a lot of hard thought, I had to give the number one spot to Shawn Michaels. He's so deserving. And it's not about what I think the world would perceive as their favorite wrestler. He just is my favorite wrestler. Looking back, definitely 
my number one. Thank you for watching.